the process was really to bring everybody in the community together. And we were hoping to get a, a nice blend of parents, students, community leaders, township governance, uh, law enforcement, teachers and administrators to have them all come together collectively to share their ideas about what's working in our school district, what's, what's great about our town, um, and then share some of the things that they have concerns with. And really to come together with our collective ideas on how to make you know, Lacey the best school district it can be and put a plan forward strategically to guide the school district for the next three to five years. Our purpose in, in starting out with what's working well in the school district and points of pride is to create a sense of the network that exists in the community. Getting people to create new relationships and you build those relationships around the positive, not around the negative. Now you can't talk about what's working well without talking about how we might want to ratchet it up to make it even better for the students and the community. I think a lot of us touched on block scheduling, block, block rocks. It does. So I think that was a good initiative, collaborative efforts at a lower level. So that's something that we always did in the high school, and it's nice to see that now in the elementary schools as well. People that take care of the grounds of the high schools or all the schools, it's, it's very well, passion is there, you can see it. All of these people are part of the community that support our schools and they, we have an obligation to open the door to hear what their thinking is about what the vision is for the future. We believe that student-centered programs um, are very successful in our town, both academic and the non-academic programs. There's a strong sense of community and interdependence among its citizens and there are plenty of opportunities for student self-discovery through extracurricular activities. Communication tools is many things. Um, any social media that's been able to get information out to students, the portal, technology, all those communication tools are very important. I was happy to see that there was a lot of parents that came out <laughs> and it was a good turnout because I thought I was going to be one of few. Uh, I learned that the uh, parents are concerned about the future of kids in the Lacey school system and that they're very proud of the facilities, they're very proud of the teachers, and they're very proud of uh, the community involvement. Tonight our focus is primarily on the vision uh, for Lacey Township uh, Public Schools. By the end of the evening, we will be listening to the 20 or so groups that are here tonight presenting their thinking in their group. And what we will begin to see is an emergence of that vision of what they would hope the school district would look like three years from now. We're talking about instilling some accountability um, throughout, you know, in terms of uh, uh, homework, testing. We would like to see increased technology and a one-to-one -one implementation among teachers and students. Um, and continuity between all four of the elementary schools. We talked about uh, the need for like uh, more technological offerings, like a one-to-one -one initiative with um, more computers in students' hands. We will take the collective information across the groups tonight and identify goal areas. So I would expect that out of the work tonight, we'll see somewhere between five and seven uh, topics emerge. In three years, we would like to see increased communication between parents and all schools throughout the district. Social media awareness help parents and educate students on responsible use. I think that's one of the things out there that we really got to focus on. To broaden the methods that we have in place to help students with the transition from graduating high school to existing in the workforce and for additional educational opportunities once they leave here. Well, I learned that there are a lot of people, uh, talented people in the community, uh, a lot of different uh, uh, areas of uh, interest, but uh, all one interest is to help the, the school improve themselves. I discovered that there were a lot of commonalities between the various groups, whether that be teachers or students or interested uh, people from the community and parents.
So tonight is our third evening and it's all about action steps. Uh, helping the Board of Education and the staff to identify what steps they might take to help enable the achievement of the goals that have come together uh, from the second evening. We're working on facilities and finance, so we're starting with the needs assessment for each of the schools to see where their funds would be best spent. E textbooks, e -textbooks. Um, current, current, current contract for current, up, current ongoing updates. We're looking at the partnership possibly to set up with the uh, municipal government and also our municipal alliance. We wanted to see how can we ensure that having more computers actually equates into better education for students. Trust and support between administration and families. I don't think it's just well, it's administration, and teachers, yes. everybody. Schools and families. I think it's just between all stakeholders. We will generate tonight several hundred ideas across the board of these uh, six goal areas and uh, it will be a tough job sifting through them uh, to figure out what might work best from those ideas. I've learned tonight um, how the community feels about all the areas that we discussed and some great ideas that we could implement um, with no cost and then some that we're going to have to find financing for if we want to implement them. It was very important for all of us to be here throughout this whole process to hear what the community has to say, what they feel are the areas that are in need of improvement, and what areas they feel we're doing well in. I think my participation individually is important because I'm a teacher in another district. Um, also, I'm a parent in this district, and uh, I'm a citizen of the community, so I feel that if you're any one of those, that your input would be important. Knowing my children are going to be set on a specific plan is very important to what our community wants to do to bring everything together. My participation as a student, particularly a high school senior who sees a lot of issues around the school, it offers a valuable perspective from within the school district.